Linktree tutorial for beginners full guide. Hello everyone. In this video today, I'll show you guys how you can get started with Linktree. So let's get into it. Now, Linktree is a simple link in bio platform where you can add all of your links together. This can be your social media links. This can also be your Amazon recommendations. This can be your Amazon affiliates as well. So it can be a great platform to integrate one link into your bio for people to be able to access all of these different sections. Now let's get started. Click on sign up for free on the top right of Linktree to get started. Then you're going to choose your Linktree name. Now this name is already taken, so I will have to find an alternative name like this. Now if this name is available, I can proceed with entering my email address like so once i've entered my email address i will click on create account and get started with my free account on linktree and with linktree you can create a free account and if you want some premium upgrades you can choose to upgrade on linktree for only uh, for only their starter plan you can start up with five dollars and then after that their pro plan is going to allow you to get access to it for 30 days for free and then nine dollars a month and their premium is 24 dollars now i'm going to be choosing the free plan over here and i'll click on join for free to get started now after that it will ask you what is your content so what channels do you want to link i want to link instagram amazon and let's say youtube as well and yeah let's say the or and pinterest as well and i'll click on continue so after that i will add my amazon shop name so i'll just add lily davis because i don't have an actual amazon shop so i'll just go over here and enter my youtube name and then we can open up our pinterest and then we can copy and paste our pinterest handle so this is our pinterest account over here and we are going to just add our pinterest username in to linktree then we also have tiktok we also have other platforms but we're just going to click on continue and now you will see that linktree is finding our content so it can build our one link now after that you can set up your profile image you can click on upload over here to upload your own logo image usually this is just going to be a picture of you and i'm just using this picture as my logo image for linktree once I click on upload over here, I can choose my profile title. This is usually going to be your display name, which you are using on your social media handles. So let's say I'm using Lily Davis and then I can add my bio. Hi everyone, visit the links below to connect with me and see my recommendations on, or see my recommendations. And then I'll just click on continue and then I can add my suggested links as well. And after that, I'll click on build my link tree. Now it's time to verify your account. So just open up your mailbox and you will get a verification email from Linktree from where you will verify your email. Now, once you have verified your email, you're going to go back in and be logged into Linktree. From here, we're going to get started with building our link tree. So on the left, you will see two of the default links that we added have been added, but I also want to add my Instagram. So over here, I will click on Instagram profile link and I can uh, go directly to the URL. I can click on connect Instagram account and I can click on connect my Instagram. I can connect via Facebook or if I want, I can directly just copy and paste the URL of Instagram. So I'll just add my Instagram URL like this, and then I'll go back into Linktree and I'll add the URL like so at Gleaming Girly, Instagram.com slash Gleaming Girly. I'll just paste that in over here. Now, once I've done that, Instagram, Amazon, YouTube, Pinterest. Now, for some reason, Pinterest is not showing up. So if I move around. This is a Pinterest link, display a preview of my link tree. And the layout is going to be classic. You can choose to also add a thumbnail layout if you want. So if I go into YouTube and I want to do layout and I can click on featured and I can make this in, in the form of a thumbnail layout if I want. This is up to your personal preference if you want to list everything in one format or highlight certain elements. So if I want to highlight my Instagram, I can go ahead and click on the Instagram profile link, click on layout and add that as a thumbnail. Now, after that, once we 
we have added all of our links, we can go into the second section on the left, which is appearances. So from here, you're going to customize the visual appearance of your link tree. And we have the classic image style, our bio. And then if you scroll down, you will have the different themes. So you will see that there are some themes that you can use by upgrading. However, there are some free themes available as well. You have quite some nice themes, nice colors as well. So you can pick out whatever theme that you like the most. So you guys can see, you know, there are some collaborations with popular, popular artists. You can even click on create your own and add your own flat color or add your own gradient colors if you want. So I'll add my own gradient because I want a dark pink gradient like this and I'll just go ahead and choose my gradient like so. I think this looks pretty nice like this. It looks more purple than pink but you win some you lose some. So once I've done that I can scroll down and choose the style of buttons I want to use if I want them to be squared, filled, if I want them to have soft shadows, hard shadows and below that you can also customize the coloring of your buttons. And then you can also customize the font that you are using. So I like to use a really simple font, something like Crimson Text, which is really simple and straightforward. Now, after that, we also have the Linktree logo, which can only be hidden if you are a premium member of Linktree. Then we have our custom background color. So this is the sharing preview. And for our custom background, we can customize our metadata. I'm just using my basic gradient background color as my background color for previews. Then I can go into analytics on the left panel and be able to see insights about my link. And now my link tree is ready and published. So if I go ahead and click on share on the top right, I can go on ahead and share my link tree in the form of a QR code in the form of a simple link. And this is the link that I have for my link tree, link tree slash the Lily Davis. And this is my link tree over here. And I can use that and people can just click on the links over here to open up, you know, my YouTube, Amazon, Instagram, and more. So that was it for today. I hope you guys found this video helpful and you are now able to follow along with these methods and techniques that I showed in this video. And if you found them helpful, make sure to share them with someone you might think that may need these. Share them with your friends, with your family, with your cousins, and share them with any business partners that you might have. And it might help you guys a lot to know all of these techniques and to follow along. And if you enjoyed this video, I would recommend that you please leave a like and if you have any questions regarding this video, regarding any other video, or regarding any social platform, then you can definitely ask me in the comments down below and I will try to answer as soon as possible. So that was it for today. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel and I will catch you guys in the next video.